Good morning, good morning, everyone, and welcome to Morning Inspirations with Pastor Tim. This is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This morning's inspiration is found in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 12. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. For so they persecuted the prophets who were before you. Jesus said, Assuredly I say to you, there is no one who has left house or brothers or sisters or father or mother or wife or children or lands for my sake and the gospels who shall not receive a hundredfold now in this life houses and brothers and sisters and mothers and children and lands with persecutions in the age to come eternal life. Persecutions come in many different forms, but it always has the same purpose and objective to hurt you, to tear you down, to discourage you and make you give up and quit doing what you are doing. It may come in the form of direct physical confrontation, or it may come to you in the form of public or private verbal communication and persecution. There are many in the world today who are wicked, evil, mean-spirited people who are full of the devil. No matter what you do in this life, there will always be haters who will find something negative or something hurtful to say about what you are doing, especially if you are doing something good in the name of Jesus, no matter what it may be. I'm here to tell you this morning, be encouraged. Let the haters hate. Do not allow the haters and naysayers to discourage you and keep you from doing whatever it is you want to do. Keep right on doing what you're doing in the name of the Lord. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad because great is your reward in heaven. Thank you for joining me today and I look forward to seeing you again on tomorrow. Have a blessed day.